<laughs> what a, I mean it's in no disrespect, uh, but in the words of Tom Brady, that was fucking awesome. <laughs> that was fucking awesome. <laughs> Oh yeah, uh, obviously. I mean, I got it. I looked up, look up to, uh, you know, a great friend. Uh, uh, it was more of like a good game. Uh, love you, and kind of just kept it moving. Can you just talk about the way everybody fought, everybody laid it all out there on the line, and guys stepped up in big moments and made huge plays? Yeah, uh, I think that just speaks to this team. Uh, I know we, we're, when we were going through our rough patch, I always just kept preaching, like, you know, the, the men in, the, in that room are the right men for, for this task. Um, and it, it was never going to be easy. Uh, we needed everybody today. You know, we, we knew that going into this game, it was going to be a 60 minute game. Um, you know, and, and uh, everybody stepped up and played well. Uh, their parts, I don't want to say well, we, all, we got stuff to work on, but everybody made plays when um, we needed them to. Uh, guys stepped up. I think uh, the, the most encouraging part was the mental toughness and stability. Uh, of this group, um, you know, at one point we all hit lulls in the game, you know, um, and uh, we just kept on fighting and, and just kept on sticking to it. And um, like I said, that just speaks to the character of the men uh, in that room. You're a team guy, but what, what does this mean to you personally, considering you don't have another schedule to start? <laughs> uh, like I said, I, I, ha I haven't even thought about it, you know. Uh, I'm just, you know, obviously, you know, grateful for this opportunity. Uh, grateful for those men in that room, um, you know, and it, this because it's the schedule one. This was a great one to, you know, kind of end it on. Uh, but, uh, you know, we've got to stack them. we got to stack them. What's it mean to get the game ball? And for Kevin, <coughs> say you got the game ball because you're a great teammate and great leader. Yeah, uh, that was super special. Um, um, <laughs> I wasn't expecting it, uh, but, uh, you know, like I, I said, like this has never been about me, you know. Um, it's always been about the team, um, and this was our team's opportunity, <laughs> um, you know, to step up in a big moment. Uh, and I think we did that. Uh, and I think the belief in the in the room, uh, in our plan, and the guys uh, when we we're out there executing, um, I think that belief never wavered. And uh, that just, like I said, it's a testament to those guys on this team. Kobe, uh, of course, Amari doesn't drop the ball. So did you see anything to him, or did he see anything to you after that fourth down drop? Oh, no, I told him I was coming back to him, and I did. What was your reaction when you saw David make that catch at the end of regulation? Oh, I can't curse because I get fined again. So I said the S word. But uh, honestly, it was, no, it, it, was, it was a great catch. Don't get me wrong, but I wasn't surprised. Uh, you know, and, um, before the, before the game uh, Saturday, talking to Kevin uh, about the plan and when we were like in the red zone. And um, originally, I didn't like that play versus that coverage. And I was like, I need, I, I want something else. And, uh, and those guys in that room, Drew, Kevin, and, and AVP, and Josh, and, and uh, Kellen, and we were just sitting there, and Deshaun just thinking about, like, why is this play good? And it was like, well, because we got one of our best players' um, opportunity to be one on one, because they're doubling everybody else uh, in that coverage. And, um, you know, I threw it and I, threw, I, I thought I threw it too high. I was about to start crying. <laughs> but uh, I seen him pull it down and I was like, oh, I could have went, ran up and kissed him. <laughs> Did you want to go? Clearly, I didn't. Did you want to go for the touchdown? Oh, hell yeah. I wanted to just put him out of misery early. Uh, but obviously, knowing the situation, uh, I know it wasn't the right decision. But uh, yeah. Your first start, uh, New England had to be very special. Does this surpass it? Oof, uh, that's a tough question. Uh, I would probably say no, uh, just because um, that was the, my first time ever getting a chance uh, to play. So I think that that's a, a very special one. Uh, not to say that this one isn't, uh, but uh, yeah. Anthony gets the gets the touchdown there on that, that first drive. Just he's had a season that's been very difficult, you know, for a lot of reasons. But just how special is that? And Secondly, the block you threw and, you know, the, you being right there step for step with them, it just. Yeah, uh, like I said, I mean, you know, we, we, every day when Schwartzy does something, we're still like, we're fans of him, you know, we're, we're good job, Schwartzy. Uh, more, <laughs> Dave is probably the leader of that, that group. Uh, but, uh, you know, and uh, obviously it hasn't been 
hit the ideal, but you know, he's a guy that stuck with it, uh, uh, stuck with it, sorry, uh, and just you know, continue to put in the work, continue to put in the work. Um, and we ran that play versus the Panthers, and he ran inside of me, and I was like, dude, don't do that again, like, like go outside. And uh, when I when I handed the ball off to the back, and I was like, oh, the end. I hope I don't have to block the defense in because that was gonna be bad. And then I was just running. I was like, nobody's even around me. Like, Schwartz, he's way faster than me. He should be in the end zone by now. And then 31 just came, and I just kind of just tried to just get in his way, and I'd end up just blocking him. Um, but yeah, just extremely happy for him. He had a, a bunch of good plays in that game. Uh, you know, he had a big catch that, that got us in a good field position. I mean, he made a great special teams tackle. Um, a guy that's just sticking with it, you know. And, and uh, like I said, that's the character of the men in that room. Gonna, uh, said you're still going to contribute with Watson in there. How do you expect to do that? <laughs> I mean, I feel like this week I feel like I've been like about to die or something. Like I'm still, I'm still, I still got a job to do. I'm still on the team, you know. Um, and I'll figure that out uh, when the time comes. But you know, I still got to be the same person every day, uh, no matter what uh, my situation or, or status is. Uh, I think that's who, what makes me me. Uh, and uh, I'm excited for him to come back and, and uh, you know, looking forward to next week. Could you two players told me in the locker room that you were their favorite quarterback they've ever played with. What does it mean to have that effect on this locker room? Was one of them Anthony Walker? No. Oh, good. All right. I knew I, I didn't, oh, that's three. All right. uh, no, that's special. Uh, you know, I don't take being in the locker room lightly, uh, being, being um, in the huddle. Um, going to work with these guys. I don't take that lightly. Um, uh, I just try to go out there and be myself, put my best foot forward, work hard, um, be somebody that the players can lean on. Uh, and I mean, that, that's a, a very, that's, that's better than the win. Where's that mindset going from? Uh, I, I guess my upbringing. Uh, <coughs> yeah, upbringing, uh, the people that helped raise me, uh, high school coaches, college coaches, uh, mentors. Um, you know, I think it just comes from them, and, and that's just, I, it's just like who I am, yeah. How great does it feel for, you know, for you to be able to help infuse new life into this team and kind of, you know, bring a little hope back into the situation? Uh, I don't think the hope went away from us. Uh, I think these, I think the guys, we show up to work every day. We're coming to work. We're not coming to lose, you know, uh, and the guys, uh, you know, continue to come to work, um, and so I was a small part of that. Uh, I was doing my job, honestly. Uh, so uh, it's not about me. It's about it's about the team. Could you tell what Miles was fighting at the end? And if so, it looked like his left arm was kind of hanging. Uh, I, I was like, I did not want to watch the defense. I was, I was like trying to look everywhere else but on the field. Uh, but I mean, Miles is tough. You know, he's he's one of the toughest guys on his team in his league, um, and uh, I'm, I'm sure he's fighting through a lot. Uh, and he, he puts the team first, and, and, and um, that's what you want in, in one of your leaders. Thanks, Kobe. Thanks. And my nephew's at the game, and I wouldn't go home without, would have lost to see him. <laughs>